From teen pop star romances to whirlwind flings, Lindsay Lohan's love life has been as dramatic as her movies. Buckle up for a look back at Lindsay's past relationships. So let's begin. Lohan's earliest known relationship was with singer Aaron Carter in 2002 when they were both teenagers. The young couple dated briefly before parting ways in 2003. Carter later claimed that he had been dating Lohan and fellow teen star Hilary Duff simultaneously, which led to a public feud between the two actresses. More recently, after Aaron's passing in 2023, Lohan reflected on their time together with fondness, mentioning so many memories from a young age. Lindsay Lohan and Wilmer Valderrama were first spotted together in May 2004. Wilmer, known for his role as Fez in That 70s Show, was her first high-profile boyfriend. Their age difference, she was 17 and he was 24, prompted them to keep their relationship under wraps until after she turned 18. They frequented the hottest clubs and parties in Hollywood while maintaining privacy about their romance. Wilmer even pulled some strings for Lindsay. As a big star, she landed a role on that 70s show. However, after being hospitalized for exhaustion, another actor took her place. Unfortunately, their love story didn't last long. They dated for about a year and eventually broke up. Lindsay's song, Over, is said to be about the painful aftermath of their breakup. Lindsay Lohan and Stavros Niarchos were spotted together in May 2006, just five days after Stavros's reported split from socialite Paris Hilton. Details about the actual relationship are scarce. They were seen together at parties and events for a brief period, but there's no information on how long it lasted. The situation reportedly caused friction between Lindsay Lohan and Paris Hilton, who were friends at the time. Lohan's next notable relationship was with Hard Rock Cafe heir Harry Morton in 2006. Their relationship started promisingly, with cozy 4th of July celebrations in Malibu, where they lounged at Morton's pad. They were spotted holding hands at a Prada party in Beverly Hills and celebrating David Spade's birthday together. However, by late September, their romance hit a rocky patch. Sources close to Morton suggested that Lindsay's penchant for drama might have contributed to their breakup. While Lindsay had cut down on partying, it seems her lifestyle still clashed with Morton's more low-key approach. Lindsay Lohan and Samantha Ronson made waves when they publicly debuted as a couple in 2008. In an era when same-sex relationships were still met with curiosity and scrutiny, Lindsay boldly stated, Yeah, I like a girl. And? Unfortunately, this openness led to relentless attacks on Samantha in the media. Lindsay reflected on this intense intrusion, saying, That's not fair. And what am I left with? Heartbreak. The couple faced several breakups before officially parting ways in 2009. Reasons for the breakup were never publicly disclosed. Lindsay stated a focus on herself, while some reports suggested a messy split. In subsequent years, Lindsay downplayed her relationship with Samantha. During an appearance on The Howard Stern Show, she described them as close friends rather than romantic partners. In November 2012, rumors began swirling about Lindsay Lohan and Max George after she was spotted attending several of the Wanted's U.S. concerts and reportedly leaving with the group after shows. Some reports suggested Max wasn't phased by Lindsay's past legal troubles and even joked she could party nearly as hard as we. Despite the initial buzz, things didn't progress into a serious relationship. Max George later admitted to a little snog, but downplayed it as a brief encounter. There were also reports of Lindsay meeting Max's parents, which could be seen as a sign of something more developing, but Max later downplayed this as well. Ultimately, it seems their connection fizzled out and Max even referred to her as a groupie. Lindsay Lohan and Matt Nordgren reportedly knew each other for several years before their romantic connection. News outlets claim they met around 2006 and reconnected in 2013 during New York Fashion Week. However, after a week or so of public speculation, it was confirmed they were already broken up. Lindsay Lohan and Vikram Chatwal, a hotelier, were friendly acquaintances as early as 2011. Rumors of a romantic connection intensified in 2013 when they were spotted getting cozy at various events and outings. This coincided with Vikram Chatwal's ongoing divorce proceedings with his estranged wife Priya Sachdev. 
Things took a dramatic turn when Lindsay Lohan reportedly confronted Priya Sachdev at a New York hotel, creating a public spectacle. This incident further fueled media attention and questions about the nature of Lindsay Lohan and Vikram Chatwal's relationship. Despite the initial drama, their romantic connection fizzled out quickly. Lindsay Lohan and Igor Tarabasov started dating in early 2015 and by April of that same year, they were engaged. Igor Tarabasov was a young businessman, significantly younger than Lindsay. Initially, they displayed their love publicly, attending events and vacations together. However, by July 2016, cracks began to show. Social media posts hinted at arguments and a video surfaced online showing a physical altercation in Greece. Lindsay then came forward with accusations of abuse against Igor. She claimed he strangled her, threatened her with violence, and stole her belongings. Igor Tarabasov denied the allegations, but the relationship ended. Lindsay focused on her well-being and rebuilding her life, while Igor remained out of the spotlight. Lindsay Lohan and Mohammed bin Salman, often referred to as MBS, were the subject of a wild rumor in 2019. The gossip mill suggested that they had developed a close relationship, with MBS allegedly flying her around in his private jets and showering her with lavish gifts, including a gift-wrapped credit card. Some even claimed they had seen text exchanges between the two. However, Lindsay's representative denied these claims, stating that they had met only once, approximately a year prior, at a Formula One Grand Prix race. Lindsay Lohan and Bader Shamas were first spotted together in early 2020, and their relationship became public knowledge in February 2020. Lohan announced her engagement to Shamas in November 2021 through an Instagram post showing off her ring. The couple tied the knot in July 2022 in a private ceremony, which Lohan confirmed through an Instagram post calling Shamas her husband. They has kept their relationship relatively low profile, with limited public appearances and social media posts about their personal life. The couple reportedly resides in Dubai, where Shamas works as an assistant vice president at Credit Suisse. In July 2023, the couple welcomed their first child, a son named Luai. Lohan has expressed her happiness and gratitude for Shamas' support in interviews, mentioning how he encourages her in her career and personal growth.